the file explorer from there you click on this pc icon it takes you into folder devices and drives then you can select the local disk c in this case you navigate and scroll down and then choose to turn on bitlocker the bitlocker drive encryption c screen is being pop up oh no what is going on here don't worry there is a way to solve the problem if all that said let's do it click cancel to exit first thing is you can open the local group policy editor press windows and our keys on your keyboard type gpedit.msc into the run dialog box and hit enter Now, in the left pane you can navigate to Local Computer Policy, Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates, Windows Components, BitLocker Drive Encryption, Operating System Drives. You can double-click the require additional authentication at startup option in the right pane. Click to enabled radio button and it automatically tick the checkbox allow BitLocker without a compatible TPM. Once it is done, click on apply and then click on OK to accept. Let's turn on BitLocker. It should work now. Well, because you don't have a TPM chip. You have to choose to either provide a USB flash drive or enter a password each time your PC boots. But I choose enter a password. Next is, it asks you where to save your BitLocker recovery key, well. There are many options. It is up to you. In this tutorial, I choose to save a file option. Click Save. Then you click on next. You can choose how much of your drive to encrypt. You can select. Encrypt use disk space only, this method is much quicker. Suggest only. It is up to you. Click next. I choose the compatible mode option in this case. It is up to you. Click next. Check that the box labeled Run BitLocker System Check. And then continue. Then immediately ask. Restart the computer so encryption will begin. Let's restart. <laughs> 